hello 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 everyone welcome back to my channel straight like that woman well, give it to you straight like that welcome back sld crew yes that will be the official name for this channel thanks to youtube pimping for throwing it out there in my comment section i appreciate that so so much sis because i didn't know what i was gonna name my channel but i thank her for that all right but uh anywho i'm only here for like a short time not a long time i just want to put out this psa that sky's life had for the peoples all right sky said y'all gonna get up out of her bed swag okay and she just won't let all the negative nances know what type of time that she is on all right but before i begin this little psa please say a prayer for the state of texas y'all know that the uh tornado hit on last thursday everybody was affected by it people lost lives people are still without power a lot of things have been happening in the last few days. Yeah, send a prayer out to all the families and hope that everything uh, gets back to normal as soon as possible. Okay, so without further ado, let's get into this PSA. And before we begin, please like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Let's get it. Let's go. We in this bitch. Finna get crunk. Abraz on fleek. The fuck? Drop that shit, DJ OJ. Yeah. 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 Bitch, I'm back. I'm popular the man. I did not come to play with you hoes. <laughs> I came to slay, bitch. I like cornbreads and collard greens, bitch. Oh yes, you best to believe it. <laughs> yeah, B. I love this shit. So let me talk my shit. Uh. All right, ready? Why you want to put people in my business? I said, damn, bitch. All right. So I'm just getting out work. I just pulled it to my house. Now I turned my comments back on. So I'm going to go ahead and let you know. Because you, some of y'all want to keep leaving stupid comments. And some of them get through. Some of them don't. Now the ones that get through. I'm going to let you know. You post a stupid comment. I'm going to hide you from my channel. I ain't even going to block you. I'm going to hide you. So then me. And all and everybody else can't even see what you post or what you comment. This is my problem with Sky's like. Sky's like don't want nobody to critique her and the life that she lived. First of all, I've been watching Sky's life for like hmm, probably like four or five years now. Okay, still the same person. She still does the same stuff. She have not elevated at all. She have not did anything for the greater good of this channel. I'm not saying that her channel is not growing, but it's growing very slowly because of the content that she puts out there. And then she keep the comments out. Sky just don't know. them Having them comments on is a part of keeping her in the, in the algorithm. You know, she don't see it that way. And I know her being on Peach McIntyre spell, she just said that before. Because Peach is the type of person, she got the tough skin. She don't give a damn what y'all say about her. Because at the end of the day, they don't make uh, dollars, it don't make sense to her. Sky don't see it that way. Can you imagine what her YouTube checks look like? Because I'm quite sure she's monetized. I mean, uh, I, but I guarantee you she's not making no money. Because Sky don't even put out 30-minute videos. All her videos are very, very short. She's not interested. She really needs to screw up herself off, off YouTube. Because her channel is trash. Ma'am. What do you do on your YouTube channel that would interest anybody? Then you got the people that's in her comments. They sitting there praising her, uplifting her, and, and, and you know, gaslighting the shit out of her. Stop doing that. That is why these ladies won't stop doing the shit that they do. Because of the, the attention that they get from the stupid people. And then they'll get in the comments and say, oh, them people just hating on y'all. Them reactors be hating on y'all. No, 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 no. We not, girl, why would we hate on somebody to keep a nasty house and, and then it's roach infested? Only time she had uh, some money to spend was tax time. We we hate on that. 
we the people, the people that work and uh, take care of their own shit, pay bills and take care of their families and don't live in a filthy ass house. <laughs> Baby, I'm going to speak for myself. Mm. Ain't living like that and ain't never lived like that and ain't trying to live like that. So, Sky can miss me with all this anger and frustration she got for her comments. It's not that deep, sis. It's not that deep. You sitting there worried about these comments, but you paying your goddamn rent through the goddamn courts because you about to get booted up out of motherfucking housing. You don't watch yourself, sis. You won't have that program because you abuse that program. So, uh, I don't care about all this, uh, you pissed off because what somebody said in the comments. Girl, is it affecting your life? Is it stopping you from doing your little, the bullshit-ass lifestyle you live? No, it's not. So, please let it go. So, then, you'll just be wasting your breath. Now, this last comment I got, I ain't even gonna talk about it. Because I ain't even gonna waste my time on it. <laughs> Sitting up in the motherfucking door, <laughs> feeling some type of way. Talking about <laughs> this last comment I got, <laughs> ain't gonna speak about. Why you brought it up, ma'am? <laughs> shit, make this shit make sense, cause I, I don't understand it. God damn. But I'm just gonna hand say that. So all those stupid comments that keep coming through, I'm not gonna turn my comments off. I'm not gonna turn my comments off. I'm gonna leave them on. But I will hide you from my channel. <laughs> girl will you just do whatever you gonna do ma'am because it's not that serious at the end of the day if you can hide that that person's comments well they won't be able to comment on your shit no more uh man why you ain't been did this you could have did this a long time ago you under peach patch spell you didn't ask peach that you just not discovering this Babe, when I say bother this a person, there will be Sky's life. I will keep you from coming. Ooh, nobody gives a shit. And the reason why I got the phone turned like this is because of my work shirt. You know the fuck, but I don't need nobody knowing where I work at. <laughs> Wait a minute. Listen here. 50 them jobs at one goddamn time. <laughs> Sky, we already know what you do, ma'am. We already know what kind of work profession that you in, sis. And then on top of that, you door dash. So really now, it's fair. Just let me go run it down to you. You work for two home health care agencies. And you door dash. Now... <laughs> Sis, you talk about what you do on your channel. See, Scott, that's why I'm saying you not elevating. Sis, the elevators ain't even going all the way up. <laughs> I can't. You're pressed about what's going on in my life. Baby, I work two jobs. I take care of my six kids by myself. <laughs> wrong word sis ain't nobody pressed shit girl thanks to the government uh helping you with your motherfucking rent and the government helping you with your motherfucking grocery bill uh so of course you better take care of the other shit what other choice do you have see sis if you had your shit together, or I don't know how far you went in school, or have you ever took a trade, or whatever the hell you got going on, sis, but what you, you could do, since you work in the, in the, in the medical field, you, you probably need to go back to school and maybe get you a, get certified where you can work you know, in the hospitals and stuff like that. That way you can make a little bit more money. You won't have to work two jobs and feel frustrated. At the end of the day, who told you to have six goddamn kids with 50 11 baby daddies? Who told you to do that? Girl, you have a long track record of having babies for different dudes that don't even give a shit about their kids. You don't get no child support. Them kids' daddies not even in their goddamn lives. The hell is you talking about? I'm going to say this, allegedly. But I just know from, from me watching her, as long as I've been watching her, it was never a dad, baby daddy in sight. She was, every time turn around, she was pregnant. 
So Sky had all these kids and she, how, how you think the kids going to get taken care of? Now, don't get me wrong. Now, she will go in the store and run up a tab. Yeah, but see how you would run up a tab if you didn't have them food stamps. So stop acting like somebody got a problem with how you working and taking care of your kids and you're not asking nobody for nothing. You ain't got to that point yet where you start begging for money like the rest of these helpers do. They dry big. Okay? Girl, get out of here, Sky, with this bullshit. I don't get on here asking for no money. None of that. I went and got me a second job. I was trying to get a third one. <laughs> that girl said I was trying to get a third one. Get your third one, sis. You do whatever you got to do and handle your scandal. Because, baby, it's not affecting my life. None of that shit. You have a daughter that's in high school. Soon, sooner or later, she going to be working. Sooner or later, maybe she going to graduate from high school. She going to go off to college or she going to get out there on her own. I don't know. But you still got five more kids to go. And she's the only one that's in high school. All the rest of them kids is young. I think she might have, what, maybe one or two in middle school. Maybe one. That big boy might be in middle school. But sis, get you a three job. Then you talk, tell us that you got a daughter that's a, a, a stay-at-home student. She She's going to school from home. What's up with that? You're such a weirdo. We don't know what the hell you got going on, the things that you be telling us. We be side-eyeing the shit out your ass because we don't be understanding because that's not what we used to. Because we see all your kids going off to school except that one child. And you trying to work all these jobs. Who at home helping this little girl? Sky, can you help your child with homework? Because we don't never see you do that. Like, your content is only consists of you cooking them something to eat and you cleaning up and your house still stay nasty. And and grocery house. That's, that's, <laughs> see, y'all learned all that dumb shit from Peach. See, what y'all fail to realize, when Peach was coming out and doing her grocery house, back then, that shit was exciting to watch a motherfucker un, you know, veil all that grocery that they finna put in their damn house. Right now, people are tired of goddamn motherfucking grocery house. People want to see other shit. What else can you bring to the table that we going to want to look at? Yeah, you know, That's the only thing we can do is look at your shit and critique and talk about your ass. That's all we can do. With that, what's up, what's up, y'all? <laughs> that's a whole nother story on what's going on with that. And then I thought about just switching jobs, period, and just getting a work-from-home job. Now, nah, Sky, what kind of job you finna do working from home, sis? What is that gonna consist of? If that's the case, why you ain't been doing that? You you been you done went through all these different type of cycles where you been with our transportation, have to walk home from work, catching Ubers, buses. You done did all this stuff. It, and when it come down to the situation like hers, I don't see nothing wrong with working from home. It's nothing wrong with that. Bitch, you should have been did that. Shit, your daughter go to school from home. She's a virtual student. What is the problem? Why are you still talking about shit that you could have resolved a long time ago? You should have been working from home. <laughs> Whatever the hell that's going to be. <laughs> what is that? Meals on wheels? You finna cook for the people and deliver food? Which one is? <laughs> what kind of work from home you finna do? But that's a whole other thing, too. But, yeah. Just because I say things on here, or just because you see things, because it wasn't even something that I said. It was something that you seen, or something I made a, I, I, I said something, but not to you guys. It's like, I was having a conversation with somebody else. It doesn't matter. Whatever these women say, they, they complain about what they're not going to discuss on the internet, but yet and still, you still discussing it on the internet. Now, she just said she don't want to talk about it, so why is she still talking about it? Can somebody answer that? And you caught on to something I said or something. And so you felt like you needed to comment. If you ain't paying my bills, stay on my comments. Because that's what that's what you your your comment was about, my bills. Okay, bingo, we got action. Hold up, hold up. Okay, so she trying to say 
the person that made the little comment, I, the child, for whatever the hell was said, I don't know. And she was basically saying that she was saying something to somebody else and they was like pretty much reading between the lines of what she said. The comment was a, speaking on her bills. And she was like, you don't pay my bills. Uh, are you paying my bills? Girl, Scott, <laughs> baby, don't make me hit you with that desk and the child. Can you pay my bills? Baby, ain't nobody trying to pay no bills for you. All the ninjas you done let up in your damn house and left and you done had children with ain't trying to pay your damn bills. You really, to be honest with you, you big mad sitting up in your damn car in the goddamn dark. All you can see is your goddamn eyeballs. And you sitting up here trying to go in on somebody. Baby, I'm going to talk about your ass. Uh, bitch, I'm going to tell you who put that comment in that motherfucking everything. What's your name? Bitch, I'm going to ask your ass and everything. If, if I'm going to be mad about it. Any other shit, I'll be like, fuck it. I don't care. Somebody got in my comment said this, that, and the other, whatever. Woo, woo, woo. I don't care. But she is really freaking bothered. Like, this whole video was her trying to chin check some motherfucking body. And ain't even put their name out there. <laughs> girl, there's a chance that they might not even be a YouTuber. Girl, they don't give a fuck if you at them. They said what they said. You already blocked them out your comment section. The fuck? Stay on my comments. Girl, then what you gonna do? <laughs> What you gonna do, sis? Because not one time did I get on here and say, can you guys help me with my bills? I said I was behind on my bills. I'm no longer behind on my bills. If you're so pressed about it, I'm no longer behind on my bills. Hold up, Sky's life. First of all, <clears throat> ain't nobody pressed about you being behind on your motherfucking bills. Bitch, we all get behind on motherfucking bills. At the end of the day, that's not nobody's fucking business. What goes on in your personal life and about your bills. But you did get your ass up on your channel and you explained all, broke all that shit down about your bills and how you paying your rent and this, that, and the third. Yes, ma'am. You did that. But here's the thing. When you got that motherfucking income tax money, I'm still sitting here trying to figure out why you just won't go ahead and pay the whole amount that you owe and stop penny pitching to the motherfucking courts is where I'm at with it. You know, and why you have to get on here and explain to somebody, oh, I'm no longer behind my bills. It does not even matter. That, at the end of the day, sis, is your business. And if you did get on this motherfucking and beg for, for motherfucking money, good luck to you, sis. And guess what? Nobody paid them but me. Bow, 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 bow. I got caught up on my bills. Except for the rent situation. Players fucker. <laughs> I'm paying it. I'm paying it currently. But my lawyer is not allowing me to pay back rent because I'm in the process of going to court. Y'all see how she's sitting there explaining her situation? Did anybody ask her to explain it? She could have just left that out. Why is she explaining this? How many people in the bag believe that Sky have a lawyer that's handling this case? <laughs> Girl, she up in this goddamn soccer mom van talking about her goddamn lawyer is handling and telling her not to pay no back rent. Sky, you is really trying to get out of not unassing that money. You really pretty much paying the courts to hold up on that goddamn eviction. If you keep playing pussy, you gonna get fucked. You gonna have to pay that shit. Just watch what I tell you. You gonna pay for this bullshit that you doing. Because what you did was, sis, you refused to pay that motherfucking landlord because you want him to come up in there and run them roaches up out that motherfucker and he didn't do it. So you refused to pay the rent. First of all, when that shit popped off and you live in roach infest and it's not your fault, go down into the housing place and tell them what you got going on with your landlord. Because one thing about them housing people, baby, what they not going to do is pay that motherfucking rent to a place that ain't fit for a motherfucking dog to live in. That's the <laughs> word of mouth, okay? Now, you think you slick. See, you couldn't go down there and tell them people that because you bought them roaches in that motherfucker. You been had a roach problem. So, really, you kind of motherfucking me came through the gate with a, a roach-infested situation. And that man was pissed off. 
and 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 didn't want to accept your motherfucking money, so you paying it to the courts. Girl, Sky Life is so lost in the South. Baby, she need help. But I had the money put away just in the case. I go to court and they say I need to pay it. So I have it. I'm glad you got it, sis. And you better not spend one dime of it in Walmart. <laughs> that girl says since she's so pressed. <laughs> girl, we not pressed. Because we ain't got to get you one penny. So since she's so pressed on my bills. And who's staying in my house? Wait, wait, wait. Uh, hold up. <laughs> where, where did it come from? Since you so worried about who, who in my house? Who in that motherfucker? <laughs> wait a minute. Sky, who in there? <laughs> who is it? <laughs> Get off my page. I'm going here, take me a shower and go to bed and get ready to so wake up, be a mother, work, and all the other stuff that I do. Good night, y'all. <laughs> Sis said, get off my page. <laughs> I'm gonna go in this house and go to bed and wake up the next day, be a mom, and go to work. Oh, let me stop. Baby, when I tell you, when I tell you, I done laugh my ass off at Sky Hood and wine glass just fucking tickle me pink, girl. Go in your house, sis. You do whatever you gotta do. That's gonna make you happy. Why the fuck do you even care? You address somebody that left a comic. Baby, I would be scared of you, baby, if somebody fuck with you or your kids. Oh, you better be on that same motherfucking time. If somebody come for you or them goddamn children, I'm trying I'm trying not to laugh. But it's just you sitting there <laughs> pulled up in front of the house in the dark of in the car. And you can't even see your motherfucking face. Girl, worried about somebody seeing your uniform shirt. Girl, we don't give a good goddamn where you work at. Girl, don't nobody even care about that piss poor ass life that you live. Girl, bye. Oh, Lord. Y'all, this is the end of her little <laughs> quick snap video. That I had to put my spin on the child to give it some goddamn life. Because, <laughs> baby, <laughs> this video was a, tr a trashy mess. But, anywho, who Lord, please like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And I'm going to see y'all in the next video. Peace out. Oh, yes, I like that.